Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I was just making myself crack up. Sorry if you guys are wiggling there. Hold on a minute. What the heck's going on? So, welcome back. If you're new, welcome to my channel. My name's Diana. Nice to have you here. Um, yeah, so hopefully uh, you guys are excited. I went to Target. I did some uh, couponing, of course. What else? And I went to Dollar Tree. Um, there's a few like wish list items that I wanted. So I did find like two of those. <laughs> I only got a few things. So I'm going to do Target and um, Dollar Tree together. It's not like a whole gang of stuff. But I got some good deals and I always like to share them with you guys. So don't forget to comment, like, definitely like. So I know to keep making these videos. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell so you won't miss a video. My CVS haul is right behind this one. I did, um, like, I think a different, a couple of different deals maybe than what I did on the breakdown. So I made out good there. I always like to show you guys what is going on at CVS and what I got. And I did go to Walgreens, but I actually have to go back because I didn't do a deal thinking that I had it wrong, but I didn't. So I don't know. I might show you guys what I got, go back, do a second haul. I'll see. But just so you know, my CVS haul is it's coming right up. So I went to Target Saturday. Uh, Nikki had to go to Best Buy, and I don't really like to be walking around Best Buy. So, of course, I said, you know what? Let me take my coupon bag and let me see what I can get. He's very quick. So I had to, like, move fast. So I had no, like, specific list or anything. So I only grabbed a couple of things. I have, uh, I had a bunch of those Nivea coupons for, the, like, the Nivea Men, the tins, the $2 coupons. So I picked up a couple of those. They're 94 cents. The coupon will be adjusted down. Um, obviously, it's better to do this at Walmart because you'll get the overage. Um, just make sure you have something to apply it to. But I got lucky on Saturday. Um... I went to the self-checkout and there was like a young guy and um, these were beeping because they, I guess, have to be pushed through or whatever. So he just put the $2 in. So I got the overage on that. So I got like $2.12 of overage. So it went towards the other couple of things that I got. So I got two of the Nivea's. Um, then I had a Amapay coupon for $5 and these are the Gel Active. You get one pair of the Ultra Slim Ball of Foot Invisible Gel Cushions. So, um, I got those for 49 cents. Not bad. Then, um, I had a coupon for the Shore. I actually still have another one left, but I don't need deodorant like that. I really was looking for the Calendula one, but they didn't have it, so I just got the regular Invisible Solid of the Shore deodorant. They were $1.97. I had a dollar coupon, 97 cents. So, um... Basically, if you think about it, I got the deodorant um, for free because I had the overage from the Nivea. So, I actually got that and the Amapay for free because um, I had like over $2 in overage there. Then, my last thing I got, they had, check my Instagram because I put um, some of the dis the end caps that were on clearance of the by the stationery at Target. They're Brit and Company, um, like planner stuff or whatever. Um, I got, it's their weekly calendar pages, 55 blank weekly pages for use with Brit and Company 6x8 inch binder. So, um, I got these, uh, you don't have to use it with the Brit and Company. Um, the size 5 inches by 7.75 inches is perfect for what I have. I have this sketchbook that I got on clearance at, um... So it'll actually go perfect. But check this out. So anyway, these were $1.48 on clearance. They were 50% off. It was like 30 to 70% sign or whatever. So um, they're cute. They have like this uh, colored pages it looks like. I'm not going to open it up. But I probably will show you when I set it up. So I got this. Um, so those are the things I got on Saturday. Then I went yesterday because um, <clears throat> I had to return what he got at Best Buy because he got it cheaper at Walmart. Ugh. So anyway, whatever. I took it, took my ass in to Target so I could get more of these. 
Um, so I got two more of these Nivea things for free. I had a $2 sheer moisture peely. I don't know where I got it from, but they had this on clearance. One of their hair masks. It was $2.11, so I paid $0.11 cents for it. Not bad. Um, their Summer's Eve, I think there's like a 10% cartwheel, and they're $1.72. These are the regular Summer's Eve, not the Simply. I had $1.50 on two coupon that we got a couple of weeks ago in the inserts. Um, so with the coupon and the, and the uh, cartwheel, it made them like maybe like $1.10 or something like that. So that's not bad. And then I decided to get one of their binders. These are also on clearance. They had all different patterns, but this is just so pretty for fall. It's pretty for all year round, and it goes with all of my decor, my white and gold decor. So um, I said this is going to be great on my, because I'm about to run out of pages. Like, I don't think I'll make it till even January, we'll have to say. So I'm going to have to figure something out. So I said, you know what? I can just start the binder. Um, yeah, so I got it for two ninety eight, fifty percent off. And I already have, you know, some starter pages with this. And then you guys know, I've said it before, I make my own pages. And then my best deal of the day was the Airwick starter kits, the Freshmatic. So um, this is the scent Summer Delights. It's got white flowers, melon, and vanilla. These are great housewarming gifts. They're great gifts for a woman or a man, but, you know, they're just great gifts. It's just nice. It comes with the can already. It's already, like, set. Now, there is, it says, like, this $4 coupons for future purchases, so we'll have to see. I don't see it, like, I don't know. We'll see. I don't see it, like, inside the label, but maybe it's attached to the can or something. So they did have ones. I got three of them. Two of them didn't have a place where peelies would be. Like, there is no peely place. Like not, It's not like somebody peeled them off. And then they had one with a peely on it for $2 instantly. So they're $4.99. So if you can go there and you get with the $2, you get it for $2.99. I happened to be there on the perfect day. I had the $3 coupon that was expiring yesterday. Expired yesterday. So I paid $1.99 a piece. So that's why I didn't use this $2 coupon. I bought the last three black ones that they had. They only had pumpkin spice left. That's iffy for a gift. I, I don't really like the smell for a fragrance. Um, I just think it's too potent, and chances are somebody might not like it. Something like this is a little bit more light. So I got the last three black ones in this scent. So I got all three for 6 bucks because I had three coupons. They were $4.99, so I paid $1.99 a piece. I'm going to see if the Target um, over here has any more in the black or even in this fragrance and I will use that two dollar coupon while they're still four ninety nine and pay two ninety nine. That is great. So one is for Nick's mom, one is for my mom, and one is either for me or maybe I'll put it away for a gift. I'm not sure. And I'm dropping ish. But four ninety nine is a great purchase purchase price. I mean that's half off. <clears throat> you could check coupon Tom.com, enter Airwick, and they'll let you know if there's any like other insert coupons. Maybe there's a dollar fifty off. I'm not really sure, but I would just go and pick it up for four ninety nine, and chances are you're gonna get one with that two dollar peely, and pay two two ninety nine. That's a killer price. So that was what I got at Target, <clears throat> and then I went over to Dollar Tree. I want to introduce to you my friend Red. This is a shout out to Lisa from Lisa's Hall. Hey girl! Um, she always like uses the abracadabra uh, finger wand that she has. I had this from like Dave and Buster's and I was like, oh my god, this reminds me of like Lisa. I said I gotta do a, a Dollar Tree haul and use this. So shout out to Lisa from Lisa's Hall. She's hilarious. Um, she's really nice to watch, like, I was in, like, not, so, I wasn't in, like, that great of a mood the other day, and, um, I put her on, and I don't know, you know, like, I, I just zoned out, and she's just really funny, light, you know, and, uh, yeah, definitely check her out, so shout out to you, Lisa, 
giving you one of these. So I just thought I had to bring this out. So I only got a few things at Dollar Tree. Like I said, there were some wish list items, one of them being salt. <laughs> the Himalayan salt. Um, I broke my salt grinder, number one. So I've just been buying like the ones at Dollar Tree, the dollar regular, you know, sea salt ones. Um, but I really wanted the pink salt. And I went there yesterday. Booyah! So hopefully this is good. Um, 13.4 ounces for a buck with the grinder. That's a killer deal. So I bought two of them. Hopefully we like them. If so, I will... I'm going to try it out tonight. If I like it, I'm going to go back and definitely get, like, another two. Um, then another wish list item. I had seen somebody haul this the other day. Is the, um... Little Trees. It's the actual fragrance uh, air freshener itself. And then it's like this holder for it. And you can stick it. So you get the air freshener and then this like plastic. You lay it in. You peel the back and stick it. So we're going to see how this smells. It was the only one they had. It smells good. Um, it's not super strong. So hopefully like this isn't old or anything. Um, we're going to see how, how good it is, and if it's alright, I am going to go back. They had a bunch, but just this one, this scent. I'm going to go back and maybe get my mom one for her, she has a new truck, for her car, and then get one for Nick's dad's truck. For a dollar, it's not bad. Um, so I got that. I was looking for the LA Colors the nails. I like the LA colors that I was getting at Walmart. You can get them for like 94 cents. But they only come in like a red, a French, a pink, and like a teal. So the pink and teal doesn't really work for the fall. So I will go with the French or the red. Um, I've been getting my acrylic with gel polish. I'm not really feeling it. Um, I just think it's a waste of money. I don't like any shape that I get. I tried the coffin, tried the almond, back to the square. I'm just not... I don't know. I, it's just not worth the $40 to me. So um, I think I'm just going to go back to doing my own press-on deal. Until I can figure out how to do my own gel set, I'm going to maybe f buy some products. We'll see. That'll be in a future video. So I was lucky somebody had just threw this. They didn't have like any left like on a display. So this is the um, Screamin'. I just don't know that they're all like sized right. We got to see. I don't know. Uh, so I got those, and then I wanted the mason jar ornament that you can make. Um, AC and more has them for a dollar. Dollar Tree last night, their shit was a mess. So I just got one of the white markers. They didn't have a gold one. I'm looking for a gold one and a white one, so I got the white one. I didn't get the mason jar. They had, like, two left, and, like, they were scratched up and stuff. So, yeah. Um, and then... I, I thought I got battery-operated lights. I'm like, wow, 20 battery-operated lights? Damn. In the white. Like, these are actually, you know, like, clear. Not, not, yeah, they're, like, clear. Um, they're plug-ins. Modern. So, um, they're not going to work for what I want, but I'm probably just going to keep them. I'm not going to, like, go up there and exchange them or anything. Because I do have, like, one of those two-foot trees or whatever, not the Dollar Tree trees. Like, you know, little display tree that I keep in the corner on my... I set it up on the corner on the uh, stand-up jewelry box over there. I put a nice tree skirt and I do it all up. Um, but the lights, it's already a pre-lit, but it could use some more light, so I, I might just throw this on. Um, I don't know. Maybe I can use them for what I want and maybe where I'm going to set this display, this lantern thing. Maybe it'll be by an outlet. I don't know. Doubt it. Anyway, that's that. Beef ramen noodles. Five for a dollar, not bad, less than a quarter a piece. You can get a better deal at Walmart, but whatever. And then, um, I know I've said this before, me and Nick, like, were playing with yo-yos for a while. I had found one, yo-yos, two yo-yos playing with a yo-yo. I found one in red at Dollar Tree, this brand, uh, a few months ago over the summer, and, um, then he got into it, he got one off Amazon, and we were, like, going crazy getting yo-yos. They used to sell these at Walmart, then I guess because they started phasing new things in and taking things out, I guess they sold into Dollar Tree. So this one is the butterfly, uh, sh you know, shape, and um, it lights up. So we'll see. I don't know how long the uh, sleep time is on it. It's Apprentice Level 2. I'm not really sure what 
level as what, but for a dollar, I might stick it in Nick's uh, stocking. You know, it'll be cute. And that's that. That's what I got. <laughs> so, if you like this video, definitely hit the like button. Subscribe, hit the bell if you're new. My CVS haul is coming up, so I'll show you the good deals that I got. And I did a Walgreens haul, but I got to go back and I don't know. So that'll be coming shortly. And ta-da, finito. So don't forget to hit the like button, comment if you have any questions, subscribe, bell, all that jazz. Thank you for joining me. Love you a ton. Shout out to Lisa and Lisa's Holes. Check her out. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. All right, everyone. Ciao.